Can we be content? Can we be yeah. at ease and joyful even while things are complicated or gray or ambivalent in this here now, presently? Like I'm always saying like, we want to grow from wholeness into greater degrees of wholeness mm. and not start with I'm broken, here's what's wrong. And then some magic formula or magic system is gonna tell us. So all those schools are gonna have some way of telling you, here's what's wrong with you. Mm-hmm. You're born in sin and you need to be redeemed. Uh, you're born unenlightened. You need to go through this whole big long thing to become an enlightened master. Uh, you're out of connection with the universal energies and the cosmic, whatever, get new AG. Like yeah, yeah. literally it doesn't matter. It can be a traditional religious thing. It can be a personal growth thing. It can be a alternative spiritual thing, whatever. They're always going to have some version of always look for, here's the problem. Here's what's wrong with you. Here's, we have the magic solution. Here's our X number of steps, magic formula to solve you, the problem of being you and human. And I'm always kind of saying, couldn't we start from a different foundation? Mm -hmm. That we're whole and our wholeness and our sovereignty may not be fully manifest in a whole bunch of different dimensions of our life. And we want to become responsible for those and bring those back into wholeness. But could we really stop with this whole starting off with we're all flawed, broken beings? Couldn't we start off with our goodness? I'm a whole being and I'm choosing to work with someone who has some skill to help me develop a similar skill to grow and deepen Mm -hmm. my wholeness. Or Mm -hmm. is it this person's going to rescue me or this system's going to rescue me or, you know, that's where it gets disempowered and where it gets dicey right away. When Mm -hmm. there's something outside of ourself, an expert, a system or whatever, that's going to be our salvation. I guess we're trying to say like how to go about it in a way that's empowering and life-giving and that doesn't subtly reinforce and undermine the best intentions. Then you'll be okay. That's always the dot, dot, dot. Mm -hmm. And to me, that's the problem because if we're not okay in some deep fundamental sense as a starting point to then turn towards the stuff that actually does need to be healed or cleared or created in our life or you know let go let go of or surrender you know whatever if we're not starting off from that place we're not getting to that place mm-hmm. and i think that's a problem and i think it really takes people down a road until eventually they realize none of these none of the practices none of these exterior technologies if you want to call them that are going to rescue us. We're going to have to become our own, our own medicine. Hey everyone, Irene Lyon here. Thank you for watching this short video. If you want to watch the full length video, just click somewhere near here and be sure to subscribe to this channel as well as my full length channel, Irene Lyon. Keep learning, keep healing. We'll see you next time.